so hey people this is me Ramit Kutuk welcome to my channel if you are new to this channel please go and subscribe my channel and don't forget to click on the bell icon to get more updates so in this video we are going to see about uh, two things one is uh, in Kerala they have found a dragon like creature which is a eel actually and it's a fish kind of thing and they named it after Lord of Rings famous character and it is said uh, its age is about 100 million years old and it's very rare and they found uh, the video also surfaced in the internet and many people uh, made it viral and they said uh, there's a dragon in Kerala and recently there was a uh, dinosaur eggs found in Tamil Nadu and now it's uh, dragon in Kerala and uh, this is believed to be a uh, it be belongs to a family of eels but uh, its age as I said it is 100 million years old and uh, it's very rare to uh, see if I found a video of that I will include that and uh, the second thing that we are going to see in this video is um, about five uh, business people from India who never attended uh, school or uh, dropped out of college so let's go to the list so people uh, before going to the list if you haven't subscribed yet please go and subscribe and click on the bell icon so that whatever video I upload will be reaching you soon and uh, comment me down below which is your favorite business people or businessmen whatever it is so please do comment me down below that also and uh, share to the maximum so let's go to the list so guys the first person in our list is uh, Amukesh Ambani in the 1980s Mukesh Ambani dropped out of an EV league school to join his father's growing business Reliance Industries while Ambani cut his MBA program short he cannot be called a dropout after all before going to Stanford he studied uh, chemical engineering at the Institute of Chemical Technology so this counts my first so let's go to the next so guys the second in my list is uh, Gautam Adani with the net worth of 25.2 billion India's second richest man quite uh, quit a uh, college at the age of 18 and uh, took a train to Mumbai with few hundred uh, rupees in his pocket to start his own business he now oversees a business empire that amongst others owns and operates India's largest private port of, at Mundra so people let's go to the next in my list so the next in my list is Azim Preetji. Uh, his net worth is about 8.1 billion. India's most generous billionaire Azim Premji dropped out of Stanford University at the age of 21 to handle the business after his father's death. He transformed a small hydrogenated cooking fat film into 8, uh, 8.5 billion global IT powerhouse called Wipro. But uh, he did return to Stanford. 34 years later to complete his graduation in electrical engineering so let's go to the next in my list so people the next in my list is Savitri Jindal with the net worth of 7 billion Savitri Jindal is the richest woman in India and the matriarch of Jindal group though she heads the conglomerate with the interests ranging from steel to infrastructure her uh, company is divided and run by her four sons Prithviraj, Sajan, Ratan and Navin. As a matter of fact, she didn't step out of the house much. She never even attended school. In, in fact, until O.P. Jindal's death, she never even knew how much her billionaire husband made. So, let's go to the next. So, guys, the next in my list is Subhash Chandra. His net worth is 2.5 billion. Subhash Chandra launched the first private television channel in India and he paved the way for the rise of Hindi television content. Chandra had a drop out of school in class 12 when his family could not afford his ed education. In 1965, he joined a small scale business to reduce the family debt. Known for his meteoric rise, Subhash Chandra added 59 channels in 25 years as he built uh, his media empire. However, his ambition to aggressively expand into various sectors got him into debt troubles. So, with this, my list ends.
so hope you like this video like it share it and subscribe to my channel and don't forget to click on the bell icon to get more updates